Hi, I'm Kevin Muller with HockeyShare.com. In this video series, we're going to take a look at progressions for defensemen. So we're going to look at some skating maneuvers, we're going to look at some shooting maneuvers, and we're going to work through progressions to just help develop your defensemen and make them more confident with the puck, more confident delivering pucks, and more confident to contribute offensively. And that's the big thing is defensemen are kind of an odd breed. They're, they're tougher to uh, train. You know, forwards, it's a lot easier to sort of train how to attack and everything like that. But... A lot of times the offensive training for the defenseman gets overlooked and so that's what this series is really designed to address is it's just a simple progression series that we put together so that you can work through your D, you can work with them and it, and it comes down to reps with a lot of this stuff. It's simple movement patterns uh, but very efficient movement patterns. Uh, it's attention to detail, it's attention to delivery. So what you're going to see in this series is we're going to set up, a lot of our drills are going to be uh, filmed with a net here, with an extra net here. The net isn't necessary, but it's good because it gives them a physical barrier when they're attempting to shoot the puck. So um, we're going to have it set here. One thing to keep in mind is that on any of these progressions, we can take the net from here and we can move it off to either side. In fact, it's actually encouraged to practice from not only the middle, but also from the side. So again, if you see a drill where we're taking a net right here and we're skating around it to change our angle and, and fire the puck, then keep in mind that we probably want to do that same drill uh, towards the walls on each side of the ice so that the D get good quality reps from different areas on the ice. Uh, not only that, if you have rink dividers you're going to see in this video series, we're going to use rink dividers a lot in our main net that we're shooting at. We're going to kind of bend them to wrap around, sort of mimic the goalie's pads when he's in a, in a dropped position, in a butterfly position. And the reason is obviously we're shooting from the blue line, so we're not really concerned about the top half of the net. We're concerned about shooting for rebounds. We're concern, concerned about keeping that puck low so that we create uh, tip plays in front and, again, generate chances in front for our forwards. So just a couple notes on that. Um, you can also use some tires if you want. Um, some of the drills will actually lend themselves very well. You can set a tire just off to the side of the net, and we can sort of use that as a mental image for something if we're delivering a pass back door, for example, or we're looking for a tip play. So just a couple uh, thoughts there in terms of ways to spruce up the training, make it a little bit more effective. But hope you enjoy this sequence, and uh, we'll see you in the first progression.